Let's hear that report again. Sir, Vessel 6 has been confirmed destroyed. Looks like we have an anomaly on our hands. What about the 401st and 903rd? I can't reach either company, sir. Keep trying. Sir! Byakuya 10! Byakuya 10! This is Kusabi. Bring me Respond. that survivor. The one from the 161st. Sir! Corporal Boz of 161st... So, you are certain you saw the enemy using magic? Uh, yes, sir! My understanding is that after witnessing this, you fled from the battle. Then your unit was annihilated. Is that correct? Yes. I, I felt it was my duty to report- In the Militesi army, we do not tolerate soldiers who flee from their fear. The 161st company was wiped out by Dominion magic. Clean this up. S sir! So even a Lassi like Kune cannot keep the Vermilion Bird Crystal in check. Well, this sucks. Where'd these rats crawl out from? sucks. Same old routine. Try something new. Let's end this right now. Now then.
we get him? Uh. Uh. What the? They summoned here? Inside my jammer field? How? This sucks.
Who are you people? Those red cloaks. No way. N Nine Tail is down. Communication lost with Kunmi. Impossible. What's going on out there? The Vermilion Bird Crystal is fully restored. Magic readings in all sectors. Wait, point 68. A Lassie? A Vermilion Bird Lassie! I've lost contact with the 204th and 208th. Get our men out of there. Attention all units in Dominion territory. Halt all military operations and withdraw at once. Retreat! Retreat! Send HQ a code 991. We're transitioning to Operation Northern Dawn. Sir! Hmm. To come this far just to be turned back. Six hours into the operation, Rubrum's Agito Cadet Class Zero achieved its objective and the Dominion succeeded in taking back its territory. It was here that Class Zero made its first mark in the pages of history. Misfortune has befallen academia and the Dominion at large. The Militesi Empire has broken the quadripartite Crystal States Pact which was forged through the courage and wisdom of our forebearers. Because of this deplorable, gravely unwarranted and unforgivable breach of faith, we have all lost many friends and loved ones. And yet, here I stand before you, proof that your strength of heart your pure and noble desire to protect our beloved Rubrum and the Vermilion Bird Crystal was strong enough to win Academia back from our enemy. I wish to express my heartfelt gratitude to the valiant warriors who accomplished this great feat. However, we must also not forget those who fell in this terrible battle. We shall drive out the Militesi forces that still unlawfully occupy our territories and liberate our villages, cities, and citizens that continue to suffer at the hands of the Empire. Rubrum is not in this alone. All of Orients must confront this challenge. I hope that you will all remember this as a new... Chancellor! Anathemic readings in Lorca! What? Oh. One day, historians may refer to this as Tempus Finis. Nonsense. This is not the beginning of the end. It is the first ray of hope, one that we've brought forth. In 842 RG, an Ultima bomb powerful enough to obliterate an entire continent was dropped on the Black Peristilium in Lorica. In the blink of an eye, the Lorican Alliance, which had stood proud for 700 years, was completely erased from the continent of Orients. <laughs> 